The other thing it has to be is evidence-based. There's a ton of research at this point that says what are the things that make sense with the brain. We don't have to be guessing, right? It's got to be evidence-based. And we try to create a similar language across all of our different competitive environments. So if they're working with me in an office space, then they're working with our strength and conditioning coach in, in the performance center, and then they're out on the court with, with our you know, on-court staff. I want all of us to be using the same language because again, if you go back to that example of focus, everybody's gotta be saying the same word and it's gotta mean the same thing. If I'm telling them one thing in the office and somebody else is telling them something different out on the court, and the, and the, the coaches will always win that battle also because they're the ones that dictate playing time. So even though I might be giving them the right fundamental, and, and then out on the court, they're hearing the wrong fundamentals, really, for mindset. They're always going to go with that because that's what's going to get them on. I've got to listen to that one because that's the one that's going to get me playing time.